Welcome everyone. I am Dr. Mike DeBoard, president of B3 Sciences. We are super excited you're joining us here live or on this recorded presentation. And you, what you're gonna see tonight is gonna shock you. This is one of those breakthroughs that maybe only once or twice happens in our lifetime. A true scientific breakthrough that moves everybody, and I mean everybody, the whole world forward in science and technology. It's called BFR, and, and you're gonna experience it tonight. You're gonna first see the science, and then you're gonna hear a testimonial, and then we're gonna show you how easy it is. And the most shocking thing is gonna be this. You can exercise anywhere, anytime, no pain, no source, don't even have to change your clothes for anywhere from four to 10 minutes and start on your way to permanent weight loss. Here's the science. As we age, look at that chart over there. When we're in our teenage years and our early 20s, most of us, we don't have any problems with weight. Why? Because we are all operating on elevated levels of growth hormone. Where does this come from? It's a nighttime natural release. It's mother nature. And you can't stop this and you can't increase it and you can't slow it down. But with age, it slows down. Look at the chart there. In your middle 20s, you're getting half the growth hormone you got in your teenage years. 30s, 40s, 50s, where most of us are, you're down to 10 to 30% of the natural growth hormone levels that you were operating at earlier ages. And then your metabolism slows down. That is how many calories you burn every day. And here's what you need to know. You have a thing called a basal metabolic rate. It's the amount of calories you burn just doing your normal daily functions. And when this growth hormone slows down, that's when you start to see changes. We all start seeing weight gain, muscle changes, muscle loss, and many of you may have additional system symptoms that go with it, like low energy and fatigue, problems sleeping, maybe decreased libido. People start noticing thin, dry skin, arthritis, loss of bone density. Guess what else people start noticing? high blood pressure, insulin resistance, atherosclerosis, varicose veins, cognitive problems. And many of us have led ourselves to what is trending in the marketplace. It's called dieting and we get trapped in it. We just think, well, if we just change our diet, try any of these great diets, and I'm not against diets, by the way, I think diets are awesome, but here's the problem. We try these things and what happens? Well, everything's great in the beginning, right? We're eat, eating less calories than we are consuming, but then your body gets smart and it slows down your metabolism. And while you're losing weight, you typically lose muscle mass and you've all experienced it. What happens when you go back to the way you were eating, you gain more weight than you lost. And then you do it again and then you do it again and you get stuck in what's called yo-yo dieting. Why? Because you are dieting to solve a growth hormone problem. Let me repeat that. This does not make any sense at all in science. We are dieting to solve a growth hormone problem. We're dieting because we're not willing to exercise the way our body was designed. What if you could? Let's all think for a second. What if we could exercise at high intensity every day and maintain optimal, awesome levels of growth hormone. Here's what would happen. Your body would go backwards by five to 15 years and your, your metabolism would skyrocket. This is straight out of Harvard. There is no other single therapy available. And when I say therapy, that means diet, supplement, gadget, tool, doctor, treatment, medicine, drug, there is nothing that can have the impact on aging and weight loss metabolism that your own God-given growth hormone that's sitting right in your brain, sitting there your whole life, waiting for you to tap into it. And there's a term for exactly what this does. And it comes out of one of our most prestigious universities. It's called afterburn. Here's what happens. When you do exercise, 
where you feel the burn and you've all done it. It's the difference between going for a walk and running the stadium steps. You feel the burn. It's the difference between going to doing some light exercise movements and lifting heavy weights. You feel the burn. You see, when you feel the burn and release growth hormone, you get a afterburn. It's a post-exercise 24-hour period where your metabolism goes up. Imagine doing something for four minutes a day. Let me repeat that. You're going to see it tonight. Doing something for four minutes a day or up to 20 minutes, but all you need is four minutes <clears throat> and your caloric metabolism burn went up 500, 800, 1,000 calories. You all know what would happen. It'd be easy for you to lose weight because you would be constantly burning more calories than you were eating. What would this be like? Remember when you were a kid, eight years old, 12 years old, 15, eat anything you want and burn it all off? The only difference between you at 12 years old and 15 years old and 50 years old is the amount of growth hormone in your body. That's it. And it's already been scientifically proven. But look, we all have the same problem, right? Time. It's got an hour and a half to go to the gym, 15 minutes back and forth, an hour, hire the trainer or workout. And then most of us are dealing with some kind of physical limitation. Me, I'm beat up. I got three joints replaced. I've got a bad shoulder, got a herniated disc in my neck. I got problems in my low back. I mean, I'd probably be in a wheelchair if it wasn't for these bands. But here's the point. I'm 58. I can't run the stadium stairs. I can't lift heavy weights. And then we have a whole group of people. You might be one of them who's doing exercise, but you're not getting the burn. Let me ask you a question. You ever gone for a walk and seen a six pack develop? You ever met a walker and they got a six pack and they got muscular toned bodies? It doesn't happen because the people who walk and do light exercise don't feel the burn. They don't elevate growth hormone. Very few people can do that. Here's the breakthrough. I'm gonna show it to you tonight. B3 bands slow down blood flow. They don't cut anything off. I just want you to imagine on the flow of blood going from your arms and legs back to the heart, you don't cut it off. It's not a blood pressure cuff. I want you to just imagine you turn down the garden hose a quarter of a turn. What would happen? The flow would slow down, which is completely safe, but now your muscle would not be able to get enough oxygen. And all of a sudden, exercise, high intensity exercise is easy. High intensity exercise isn't an hour anymore. I'm gonna show you four minutes, it's quick. And it doesn't hurt and you're not sore, which means everybody of any activity level, of any demographics, in any situation can do it. And you're gonna see big time. I'm not talking about a little change. I'm talking about big time metabolism results. It will be like you're 15 years old again. You will be surging growth hormone with workouts like four minute legs. Let me ask you, could you simply put these bands on, get out of your desk, get out of your chair, whatever you're doing, and do something for four minutes or even 10, 15. Hey, if you want to go crazy, get crazy. We got 20 minute workouts. I mean, that sounds crazy, but that's almost a crazy, you don't even need to do a workout, but you can. But we got four minute workouts. Tonight, you're going to do a version of three minute arms. Ladies, men, not only are you going to turn on growth hormone, feel younger, but you're going to get lean toned arms, ladies. Guys, you're probably going to put an inch or two inches on your arms in the first month or two. In addition, here's the proof. This is a study on middle-aged men doing exercise with and without BFR bands like B3, 25 times increase in growth hormone. This isn't a little bump in growth hormone. This is like you're an Olympic level athlete, surging growth hormone. And I mean, boy, are you going to feel it? I mean, you're going to feel like somebody shot you out of a cannon every day. You're going to have energy. You're going to sleep better, vitality, and your body's going to lean up and you're going to look and you're going to feel younger. Look at this lady. This is Holly. When I met Holly, God bless her. I met, him, met her up at Janine Grohl's awesome family, grow family fitness gym in Preston, Idaho. She couldn't even get out of her chair. And I won't go into a long detail, 
but we can take people in wheelchairs and are un- immobile and be able to start them with a couple minutes. She's lost over 200 pounds, got her life back. She's working. I mean, complete. She was stuck, everyone. There's no trainer, no doctor, no university, no pill that's going to fix her. The only thing that's going to help her is somebody would have to figure out how to get her muscles to contract and produce growth hormone. We did it. And congratulations to her. Well, let's hear from somebody that has completely changed her physique. And I mean, she'll tell you, it's like somebody shot her out of a cannon every day with energy. Sarah Larson, I'm going to bring her up, but I'm, I'm going to have her talk for just a second. And then I'm going to bring her up live. But look at this physique on her. I mean, this girl is put <laughs> together. There's no saggy arms. There's no drooping, no anywhere. This girl is operating on elevated levels of growth hormone. So, Sarah, I'm going to stop the share here and have you uh, – Share with everybody your exciting story of what you've done to get here with B3. How are you doing, Sarah? Well, thank you, Dr. Mike, for those compliments. That's very nice of you. I'm doing great. Awesome. Well, I'm working on um, you up, but go ahead and share your story. So I've been using the bands now. um, So November will be exactly two years. And when I first um, started the bands, I was working out for about two hours a day. prior to using them. And I was kind of at a plateau and um, was really trying to redefine my body and, um, and was introduced to the bands and had to kind of really tear down my workouts from that two hours and get into a whole new concept of, of, you know, that 20 minute workout. And I'll tell you at first, it was hard for me, um, but whittled it down. And and really that first 30 to 45 days is when I first started to see that change. Um, and really in that s- probably six months, I saw a huge change in my body um, and a, a, a big change that, you know, dropping drastically, um, losing about 12% body fat and gaining about 9% muscle. And that was like a huge goal for me. I wanted to really put on muscle, really um, drop that body fat percentage down um, and that allowed me to really contour and, and get my body to where it is. Um, I'm, I'm 49 years old and to do something like this at, at my age, um, you know, most women can't or don't expect to, to get in this shape. Um, but, and on top of that, to have the energy, um, to do the things that I'm doing, um, you know, Sandra Chegetz and I last week just hiked, um, 16 miles. Um, and if, and I, and I have something directly to compare that to. Um, four years ago, I had done four, a four mile hike and it took me um, almost 16 hours, well, over 16 hours to do that. And I was not in good shape. Um, and so with the bands, I can directly correlate those two. Um, we probably could have done it faster, but we had someone that we were helping along that was much older than us. Um, but I literally could wake up the next morning and do it again. I didn't have soreness. I didn't have um, any of that lactic acid buildup that I've had before um, my first hike, I was completely sore and couldn't walk for a week. And the training I get with the bands of just working out for 20 minutes a day, sometimes not 20 minutes, maybe it's just 10, eight or 10 minutes, I can get into those workouts. And I'm maintaining now for almost two years um, and continuing to put on muscle, continuing to shape my body. And, you know, and I'm continuing just to push myself further and just have so much energy to continue to, to push my limits to see how much further I can go. Sarah, what have you seen in the people that you've turned on to the bands? Because I know you've helped a lot of people. What, what do you see in them when they use the bands? Um, so I, I think the, the funnest thing is when I, I do a demo with someone, they're like, okay, that's nice. And then they call me the next day and they're like, okay, I got to have these. I'm sore. And these are you know people who are athletes and, um, and, they're, and, and they're shocked that you know, when they've been training and they've been working towards something um, and their regular workouts are completely changed by a four minute, a four minute leg exercise, the four minute booty that we do. Um, and that's what I'll typically do um, with them. Um, I've seen um, women who call me after getting the bands for the first time. And an hour later, they're asking me, why do I have so much energy today? And I'm telling them, you know what, you're getting growth hormones. It's the first time in college um, that you can recognize. And they're like, well, why? how do I get this every day? I'm like, just keep using the bands every single day. And, um, you know, and, and 
and that's the biggest thing for us women, you know, over the age of 40 or you, late 30s to 40s, getting that growth hormone and that energy is just like priceless. You know, we always say, how do we bottle the energy that we have in our grandkids or in our kids when they were little? This is this is that bottle. It, the bands are are that ener- is that energy that's bottled up and we're just letting it out of the bottle. And so um, we finally have access to it. And um, I run circles around my kids um, that are, my youngest is 16, my oldest is 30. And we get together and they're like, mom, please, we just don't have that energy <laughs> that you have. And, um, and I love being able to say, let's get out and do these fun things. And I have the energy to do that with them. Awesome. Thanks, Sarah. You're, you're an inspiration. You're always posting. And I mean, I, I'm inspired every time I see you and Mike work out, man, you've helped a lot of people. We got a lot more to help. So thank you for everything yep. you're doing and, and, and joining us tonight. You're welcome.